Stevie Kingo. Reverse to the corner, but the Bandera sends Dralisco to go out to the apron. Dralisco, oh man, kicking that turnbuckle pad, but going right into the face of Vikingo. And Dralisco goes straight forward into the lung blower. And they can do it. Look at this. Dralisco covers and Yeah, it's a, the championship is on the line, held by the gentleman that is on his back. Yeah, the gentleman on his back pushed hard with his very strong legs to get him out of that penny predicament. And the official in this match, yeah, referee Brandon yeah. Martinez. Look at that creep with him. He's a troublemaker. Uh, Jose, not, not Brandon. Brandon. No, not, not Brandon Martinez. Great referee. I'm talking about this creep who's sitting at the table. And I was going to point out that Brandon Martinez, himself bilingual, a great asset to have in these Lucha Libre encounters. As the table is set up. Commander it worked over by Jalistico. Starting to get a little unraveled here. No telling what's going to happen. AW Rampage back here on TNT. Our first of four championship matches. Dralistico and Commander are looking to unseat El Hijo Del Vikingo as the AAA Mega Champion. And Dralistico has been dominating this match. And he and Jose have put up the table outside the ring. The champion, as we praise so much, is only 25 years old. Yeah, but he's been around Lucha Libre all of his life. A great second generation star. His father, the original Vikingo, and now Commander. Springboard up. Comes back at the hook on Rana. Drops down Tralistico. Vikingo is back up. And Commander, I'm not sure he realized it. Now he does. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. He slips. Arm drag. That's where you avoid contact. Great torque on the arm drag drop kick. Wow, that's amazing arm drags. And now Trilistico and Vikingo teeing off on one another. Commander. Big Commander! Commander just walked the top rope and stepped a big move. Absolutely fearless. Fans loving it. Watch in there. That's a piece of art right there, folks. Defying gravity, being fearless, taking a chance to try to win the title. Now, Commander, with Drillistico in the ring, he's got an opportunity to put him away, to come away a champion. Remember, the champ does not need to be pinned for the title to change hands. What's he doing? He's got one on the outside, one on the inside. Commander, 450 splash after the tight rope walk. Oh, oh the double stop by Vikingo to break it up. The champion breaks it up to maintain this match, continue this match more specifically. Vikingo was watching the entire time from the outside. He made his mark. Vikingo. He doesn't oh. wrestle like a 25 year old. Vikingo steadies himself on the ropes. The bounce, and then, oh! Goodness Holy smokes. Corkscrew reverse work on Rana. Commander got spiked. And Vikingo. Oh, I've got someone on my mind. It's big. Oh, Vikingo. He's, he's looking to take two guys out. Here's a champ. Oh. Well, he got one of his targets. Yikes! 630 centon from the middle rope. Inside out, and Dralistico, he rolled off the table. Commander, he hurt his lower back on that, and Dralistico looking to take advantage. Should be a big, big win here for the masked man. Oh, no! no. Oh, oh, counter. Counter. Oh, One, counter. two, yes! Vikingo! Out of nowhere Ooh. came that counter. This match and still, Triple A Mega Champion, El Hijo de Vikingo! Well, like 547 days as the champion. An incredible performance by Elio Del Vikingo, outlasting two other men and persevering through the lower back injury. Suffered when he did that 630 cent down through the table on the outside. Let's take another look. There you see Vikingo crashing down on Commander and immediately clutching his lower back. Called on high risk moves for a reason, but Vikingo able to counter the powerbomb attempt with a work on Rana to roll up Dralistico, score the win, and defend his AAA Mega Championship.